you wouldn't believe how strange some animals sound. Let's take a look at 15 unexpectedly funny sounding animals. Number 15. The noise a fox makes is so mysterious that a song written about it made it on top of a hit singles charts. So let's finally settle this debate and see how a red fox actually sounds. Red foxes are canids, like dogs and wolves, and have a wide variety of noises and sounds. Their vocalizations range from simple dog-like barks to extremely high-pitched, almost scream-like cries. And the rarest noise of them all is the chattering, or geckering, which is heard amongst adult foxes during aggressive encounters. Number 14. Rhinoceros. While full-grown and mature, rhinos can be somewhat scary and unnerving. Baby rhinos are a different story. The 3,500-pound or 1,700-kilogram wild animals sound nothing like one might expect, and their unusual noises makes them even more charming. <coughs> While rhinos are usually quiet animals, they make distinct high-pitched sound when they get excited. Immature rhinoceroses are known to sound like the neck of a balloon when the air is let out while grown rhinos prefer dominating growls. Number 13. Walrus The walrus is a widely underrated animal. One may have a lot of expectations when it comes to the 2,200-pound or 1,000-kilogram marine mammal, but in reality, walruses are some of the most talented sea creatures on Earth. If properly trained, they can make incredible noises. who she wants to mate with. Whistle! Good. From loud grunts and howls to more soft whistles and clicks. These animals can pretty much learn any noise that their larynx and vocal cords allow to display. Number 12, hyena. The legend that spotted hyenas are called laughing hyenas is actually true. But if you ever stumble upon a laughing hyena, remember, they're not displaying joy. <laughs> These spotted creatures often start giggling when they are feeding on prey, or when a more dangerous predator is near them. But did you know that their laugh also represents social status? More dominant hyenas make lower-sounding laughs, while the subordinates giggle at a higher pitch. While these pitch nuances can't be heard by human ears, the distinct giggles bring order to the packs. Number 11, koalas. Easily one of the most adorable and cutest animals adored by millions all over the world are the koalas. And while their small size and innocent faces bring joy to every zoo attendee, their noises are anything but sweet. You'll be shocked to find out that these small Australian creatures make some of the most unsettling noises. When searching for a suitable mate, male koalas are known to make a deep grunting or bellowing sound. These sounds are produced by an extra pair of vocal folds which is specific only for the koalas. Number 10, lynx. Even though the lynxes are considered to be of the cat genus and family, the sounds these wild animals make are far from the pleasant meows. The snow-loving lynxes are considered to be one of the most graceful big cats of the wild. Mostly inhabited in Canada and Asia, lynxes are covered with beautiful thick fur that keep them from freezing in the cold environments. But don't be fooled, as their conversation noises are nowhere near delightful or alluring. You have heard of lion roars and tiger growls, but have you ever heard of two lynxes fighting by screaming? Yes, when these big cats open their mouths, horrifying sounds can be heard from miles away. According to zoologists, even though the lynx has large teeth and powerful claws, the species prefer to first iron out their differences with aggressive calls. Physical combat or fight can be gruesome for both animals involved, so instead, they choose to vocalize their hostility. But high-pitched, terrifying screams aren't the only type of noise these cats can make. If a lynx wants to attract a mate, it will make a long, wailing call, while the low growls are reserved for territorial battles and claims. It's surprising to find out that these 15 to 30-pound animals can make such frightening noises. Number 9. Elephant we're taught from childhood that an elephant's long and majestic trunk makes a trumpeting noise. But you may be surprised to find out that an elephant is much more talented when it comes to vocalization. Elephants are some of the largest land mammals on Earth, 
An average one can weigh up to 9,000 pounds, or around 4,000 kilograms, and their distinct trunk makes up 300 pounds, or 140 kilograms of their total size. The elongated body part has many different functions. Trunks are not only used to pick up objects, suck up water, and bathe, but they can also create warning trumped noises, or greet other friendly elephants. When it comes to their vocalization, their most famous noise is the trumpeting, or rumbling, that's made when air is pushed through the trunk. Many trumpeting elephants can create a unique elephant orchestra that will feature different pitch noises played at the same time. But what's more interesting is that trumpeting noises can mean many different things. When its length and nature is changed, if a lion is noticed nearby, an elephant will create short trumpet blasts that will alert the herd of the danger. But if an elephant is just happy and wants to play, it will make full-blown shouting noises and often swing their trunks around. As mentioned, elephants can produce a wide variety of noises and aren't confined to just trumpeting. These big mammals can actually roar, bark, grunt, and snort as well. They have the ability to imitate other sounds heard, so if you hear a loud roar in the wild, think again before you assume it's a big cat. Before we move on, be sure to subscribe to Top 5s with notifications on. Number 8. Gibbon One species of monkeys that are often overlooked and forgotten about are the gibbons. These small monkeys typically live in eastern Asia and subtropical forests. But unlike other big apes, they seem to lack high cognitive functions and abilities. Nevertheless, their voices and sounds are still impressive for such small animals. The gibbons make a characteristic noise, often called the Great Call. These fluffy animalize vocalize in almost song-like ways, and their musical sounds are mostly heard in the morning. Not only are their noises pleasant to the ear, but gibbons often sing in pairs by harmonizing their calls. These coordinated duets are a sign of dominance, and can only be produced by female gibbons. As they start out with loud notes, they often change tempo and pitch, displaying their territorial boundaries and superiority. And while these peaceful songs can sound the same to humans, gibbons are actually one subtype of monkeys that have a distinct regional accent. It's also very common to encounter many different subtypes of gibbons in one environment. And so what may sound like one gibbon may be two subspecies harmonizing in synchrony. Number 7. Ostrich Ostriches are one of the most unique creatures in the world. Not only are they the largest birds on Earth, but they're also flightless. These strong runners often roam African savannas and deserts, and typically around 300 pounds or 130 kilograms in weight. Another trait of the ostrich that makes them so special and unique is that unlike all other wild animals and birds, ostriches are the one species that make no vocal noise. While other creatures may produce high-pitched noises or low growls in order to attract mates, the male ostrich makes a noise that is specific to their kind. The largest birds in the world create a booming noise without ever opening their mouths. Ostriches have the ability to inflate their necks three times its normal size and produce a low, booming voice. And while the males are booming with their necks and beating their wings, female ostriches are somewhere near hissing in return. Once the pair find each other, they continue making their distinct noises until their actions become synchronized, at which point the mating ritual can begin. But when it comes to baby ostriches, their vocalization is totally different. These immature birds make noises that sound like dinosaurs. Their high-pitched cries are of significant importance, as it helps them blend in with the surrounding environment, making them less detectable by large predators. Number 6. Beetles what comes to your mind when a beetle is mentioned? Probably the iconic UK band, not the large bug. But interestingly enough, just like the music band, these insects are known for their specific sound. Many may not know this, but beetles are the largest order of insects and have around half a million different types of subspecies. These larger than usual bugs are often encountered near forests and ponds, and their particular sound is another trait that sets them apart from the rest of the insects. One unique subtype is the ten-line June beetles, which are also known as the hissing beetles. This North American subspecies have distinct defense mechanisms that ultimately make hissing sounds. When a predator is nearby or when the insect is disturbed, it automatically rubs its wings against its abdomen, which forces the air out and makes the famous whistle-like noise. But if you think the hissing beetles are interesting, wait till you hear the Hercules beetle. This subspecies has an apt name, because not only are they the biggest beetle species in the world, they are also one of the largest flying insects as well. 
Hercules beetles have such powerful wings. When they swing, they create a jackhammer-like sound that's terrifying to humans, too. Imagine what the little insects feel when a Hercules beetle is nearby. Number 5. Possum What's a terrifying animal to most can be a cute pet to others. Possums are marsupial creatures that are native to Australia and Papua New Guinea. But these little wild animals have gotten close to living near humans and are now considered to be loyal pets. The nocturnal species love to roam around in the dark and prefer to be by themselves. But when they're in contact with other animals or humans, they can create some very unusual sounds. The possum has a range of vocal noises it can produce within seconds. Researchers and zoologists have documented over 18 different possum sounds, from grunting and growling to clicking noises. These little guys are much more interesting than meets the eye, especially if one stumbles upon an unwanted possum in their attic or roof. Their noises can be terrifying to the core. The brush-tail possum is one subspecies that's highly talented in its vocal range. Its aggressive noises often resemble that of a wild pig, and their sounds have often been described as a throaty cough. Like the rest of the wild animals, grunting and growling noises are often reserved for when mating season is just around the corner. But when a possum is under stress or feels a tense environment, they create a pretty unexpected sound. A ringtail possum, another subtype of the small marsupial, will produce chattering calls or buccal clicks when they're stressed or concerned. Mother ringtail possums often create these noises when they're looking after their new babies, as their protection and safety is the number one priority. Fun fact about the highly vocal marsupials, when possums are hurt or in pain, as a self-preservation reaction, they'll go silent and make zero noise. This silence makes it harder for predators to track down the little creatures, as the injured possums become very easy prey. Number 4. Cheetahs Cheetahs are some of the most dangerous big cats in the world. Not only are they massive in size, but their speed and anatomy make them the fastest land mammals in the world. But apart from being huge and dangerous, there's one thing they can't do. Roar. One might expect truly terrifying noises from the predators, when in reality their vocalizations is limited to little chirps and high-pitched yelping. But why exactly can't these big cats roar? They certainly look the part. When it comes to loud roaring, it comes down to simple anatomy. The blaring, bellowing noise is made possible by a special two-piece hyoid bone in the throat. And while other big cats like lions, tigers, and even jaguars are blessed with this talent, cheetahs are only born with one-piece hyoid bones and can't roar even if they try their hardest. Cheetahs are special species of mammals as they're often big, friendly cats that resemble pets in our homes. These predators often purr when pleased and might even seem harmless for a second. But don't make a cheetah angry. Their purring will transform into a loud howling and yelping noise within a second. Number three. Turtles. Turtles are some of the oldest living reptiles on Earth and can live up to be a century old. But did you know that these little sea creatures and pets can actually make all different kinds of noises? While most sounds can't be detected by human ears, there are still a few that can shock the pet owner. Turtles don't actually have vocal cords but are still capable of producing a wide range of noises. Some may cluck like chickens, whilst others prefer more high-pitched whining sounds. When it comes to pet turtles, the most common noise they make is the hissing sound. You may assume that when a turtle hisses, it's because of aggression or hostility, when in reality the turtle is simply scared. Unlike other pets, like dogs and cats, turtles don't like to be touched. So when a pet owner is admiring the creature, an involuntary sound may be produced as a sign of fear. But the one noise that's so funny to discover is when two turtles are mating. They create distinct noises that are hard to explain and are often described as a continuous cry. A male turtle may create these noises a couple of times, and it's just an indication that the animal is having fun. Number 2. Porcupines The highly unapproachable and harmful porcupines are creatures that create some of the funniest noises. These creatures are often kept and trained as house animals, and their distinct noises have been documented numerous times. Porcupines are the prickliest of the rodents and can even kill lions if their quills are stabbed through in the right place. Many big cats and predators try to prey on these rodents, but most often are left with disappointing results and painful pricks on their paws. But did you know these secretly dangerous animals produce cute noises? Porcupines were thought to be noiseless creatures until footage of their vocalization started to surface on the internet. When porcupines are delighted or are enjoying a delicious meal, they'll create noises that sound like pleasant whining. Their sounds are often expressive and animated, and if you tickle a porcupine, it can even make a cute squealing sound as well. 
But if you encounter a wild porcupine, try to stay far away from it. Remember, these somewhat cute rodents can actually kill big predators. Number one, Mockingbird. One bird that has by far the most impressive vocalization range and variety is the Mockingbird. The versatile songbird is known for its mimicry talents and skills. Mockingbirds are capable of copying and imitating songs within 10 minutes of hearing it. These colorful birds can also sing high pitches as a self-defense mechanism and a way to protect their rightful territory. But the best defense mechanisms these small birds are born with are their ability to mimic other animals and most importantly, deadly predators. Some mockingbirds may mimic predator noises or other threat calls as a way to protect their nest and discourage other birds from claiming their territory. These talented birds are known to mimic hawk or owl screeches, and if introduced to a new environment, it can even adapt to mammalian sounds. But apart from self-defense, these colorful songbirds also create special tunes for appropriate female counterparts. When it comes to mating, a female mockingbird will often choose a male that's more skilled in singing or has a more unique sound. As adult mockingbirds can emit up to 200 distinct noises and can even create original tunes and songs, it's safe to say that mating is not a big problem in their environment. But one fact that's so fascinating and unique about these small birds is their ability to adapt to any foreign sound in their habitat. Mockingbirds can copy almost any sound, natural or artificial. So when a camera crew's picked up a car siren noise from these birds, they were left in complete shock. What's one species of bird that can make cell phone ringing, camera stuttering, and car siren noises? It's the mockingbird. Subscribe to Top 5s for more and check out some of our other popular videos.